Hi, welcome back. Previously, we unboxed the LilyGo T3 S3 e-paper. It's a Mesh-tastic compatible device. It doesn't run the new Mesh-tastic user interface, which would make it a standalone device. There's no user button and the, there's no touch on the screen. So you're primarily, you're going to interact with this device using a Bluetooth connection to your cell phone or your PC. The screen refresh on e-paper is a little slower, so I recommend setting the carousel, the rotation between the displays, to 10 seconds. That works out quite well. It is a compatible Mesh-tastic device. I searched for a long time looking for LilyGo T3 S3 cases on Thingiverse, and then I found it by jamming T3 and S3 together, and we came up with this case here. It looks a little large, but it does have lots of room for a battery. There's room for a GPS, and it does fit quite well. Let's see, to assemble it here, we gotta take the antenna off. There's hooks along here. Get it up underneath here, and then there's little snaps on this side. It's not gonna fall out of there. Yeah, there's a little switch. I'm not gonna bother trying to align the switch right now. You'd wanna align the switch while you're doing that. Just, you gotta take the antenna off to get that through there, and then you can put the antenna back on. What I like is it will sit on the desktop, they specify using melt nuts, where you actually melt the nut into these holes here, and then you use the screws on this side. And I've never done that before. I ordered some. We'll see how that works out. But I also see where you could close this case by using Velcro on these, or maybe a zip tie on these. And these are also handy for hanging it somehow, mounting it somehow. So, anyway... This is a decent Mesh-tastic compatible device, and I like this case, so look for the links down below. Thank you very much.